All right, so um, how many of you have lots and lots of data that you don't want to tag yourself because there's too much of it? Or lots and lots of images that you're looking for something very specific that you cannot teach the computer how to find it? So basically, I had lots and lots of programs, lots and lots of pictures of newspapers that I had to tag, and I really did not have the time, energy, or you know, uh, brain power to do that many of them. And the best way that I could think of to do it was to do crowdsourcing, to create a platform to let other people come, spend five minutes, tag a few of these images for me. Unfortunately, the people I applied to do the crowdsourcing platform with, they had too much demand at Zooniverse, I couldn't get really the professional ones. So I invented sort of a MacGyver way of doing it behind the scenes. So if you are a one-person researcher or a two-person researcher, you want to have a really robust crowdsourcing platform that looks really nice, but you don't want to have to create a whole back end. I'm going to teach you how to do it with a workflow of existing tools so that you can go straight from the crowd to tabular data with all the information that you need. And it's completely practical, and you get to play with some weird XML. 